threat is so effective, and now they have another guy in Jalen Strong who they can throw the ball to. Couple of fakes. Kelly Moore. From TV, you got to make those kinds of plays if your team's going to win. They're at Stanford next week, then USC at home, then Notre Dame in Dallas. Harley, second down and five on the 40 yard line of Wisconsin. Borland coming again, and Kelly can't get away from him. No, he does. Play clock down to two. Here comes Borland. Just, he's too quick for the offensive guard. He forces a high throw there, no question. Wisconsin's defense only in this game. Third and 12. Under pressure, Braxton. Great escapability. Dances. Miller back to pass on third down. And it's first and ten for the Buckeyes. Well, you see, watch Chris Borland in the middle of this defense. He's outside, he's inside, he's reading the quarterback's eyes, and he got over there just to... Jesse, of course, have all the highlights and stories from games earlier in the day, including Oklahoma Notre Dame. Second down and 15. Braxton Miller being chased. Dances back with a great running ability. I like the uh, Paul Bunyan axe. Luganville had a slab of bacon on his uh, breakfast plate this morning. <laughs> Nelson throwing from his end zone on first down going and he makes just about every play on this defense They've been blitzing him a lot more and here he comes chasing down Nelson and Nelson had to step up a little bit third down and 11 Out of field goal range here Chris Hawthorne their field goal kickers long is 45 this year Nelson in trouble Borland trips him up Nelson gets hit the ball's fumble Borland tries to pick it up and he's got it Tight end yeah good you're more of a blocking tight end Fourth down and ten. Rolling out Nelson, trying to throw it back to Cobb. And that play had no chance. Well, there he is. Take a look. They're just going to try to throw it back, but you're not going to fool one of the smartest players in college football. He's all over it. And one-on-one -on -one in the open field, he's not missing that tackle. Quarterback. They're going to do it with Caputo off the edge. They were creased by Penn State in the last game of the year because they allowed... Christian Hackenberg to sit in the pocket and pick him up. An advantage once they bring pressure off the edge defensively. Now Borland coming here. And he's chasing Connor Shaw. Has to get rid of the pass. And coming back to the ball was Shamir. Borland matched up on the center. This is the matchup they like. Cody Waldrop has struggled in pass protection. You see the athletic ability of Chris Borland. And when you try to cut him, he is not going to stay down long. He's like the Energizer Bunny, a 